Good morning. Welcome to Toothy Trivia. I'm your host, Dylan, from Wacky News, standing in for Emma, who is sick. Go ahead and get your toothbrush ready. I hope you're ready to have an awesome day. Now it's time to make brushing your teeth for two minutes fun and easy. Are you ready? Let's go. Today's trivia theme is magic. Harry Houdini is probably the most famous illusionist ever. He was also president of the Society of American Musicians from 1917 to 1926. It started in 1902 with 24 members. Magicians Siegfried and Roy staged the most expensive magic show in history with a price tag of $35.7 million. Dozens of wild animals, a fire, breathing mechanical dragon and a cast of 60 dancers and performers worked during the 5,750 shows performed in Las Vegas. Magician Doug Henning attracted over 50 million viewers to the first of his eight World of Magic one-hour NBC specials in December of 1975. The longest-running TV magic show was Dick, Mr. Magic Williams, WMC-TV's Magicland. Over 23 years, from January 1966 to January 1989, over 1,200 shows aired. Lots of magicians use birds, rabbits, and other animals in their acts, but 80,000 animals in one magic act? Penn and Teller produced 80,000 bees during one of their TV specials. Magicians are no strangers to danger. Australian Robert Gallup was leg manacled, handcuffed, chained, and placed into a secured mail bag and locked in a steel cage. He was dropped out of a C-123 transport blue plane 17,000 feet above Mojave Desert. Traveling at 140 miles per hour, he freed himself, retrieved the parachute attached outside of the cage, <laughs> in time to land safely. Don't try this at home. The earliest recorded magicians date back to ancient Egypt ancient Rome, and ancient Greece, so we do know that even the earliest people had those who were believed to have special powers for healing and prayer. If you like these episodes, be sure to tell your parents and dentist to subscribe to Toothy Trivia on iTunes, Google Play, or Stitcher. We can also be found as Toothy Trivia on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.
Nice, Dylan. Okay, so let's really quickly read. Yeah, it's gonna take me forever. You're, you, you really did a great job, sweetie. And the second part of magic is, is easy. And then we're gonna go to your class. So here we go, Dill. Okay. Eliza. Um, Eliaser. Eliaser Bamberg. The... Oh, wait, say, um, say once more. Today's trivia theme is magic. Today's trivia theme is magic. Eliza. Eliaser. Eliaser Bamberg, the 18th century Dutch magician was known as the crippled devil. He had, lo- he had lost one of his legs in an explosion and wore a wooden leg. The story goes that Eliza, Eliaser. Eliaser had hollowed out his wooden leg and used it as a secret hiding place for his magic props. Today, today there are many books of magic that can teach anyone how to perform tricks. During the during the Renaissance, Renaissance? Mm-hmm. during the Renaissance, there was no in. There is no such instruction manuals. Illusionists pass the secret of their trade from one generation to the next. And this I wrote down masculine. Okay. When was when the Second World War broke out? British illusionist Jasper Jasper Maskeline was quick to offer up his skills to the War Department. How can a magician help in the war? Well, he was given out. Well, he was given his own unit of 14 men known as the Magic King who created an illusion of a German battleship on the Thames, Thames, Thames River. Thames River using mirrors in a model ship further further re- and, and further deceived the and Germans. further deceived Wait till I stop talking. And further deceived the Germans with inflatable tanks, fla- fake railway lines and an optical illusion to hide the Sioux Canal. Canal. Houdini is one of the most famous illusionists in history. Nicknamed the King of Handcuffs, he was especially known well as an escape artist. Apart from inventing and performing illusions, he owned a share in Mar- Martinka's? Mm-hmm. Martinka's Magic Shop in New York, New York City and was the present society president uh, of the of the Society of American Ad- Magicians from 1917 until his death in 1926. This is the oldest magic society in the world and was founded in Martinka's on May 10th in 1902 with only 24 members. Invented by South Africa invented invented by South Afri- African Robert Harbin in 1965, the Zigzag Girl is the most popular popularly per, popularly 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 is the most is popularly. the most commonly performed it's the most commonly performed stage illusion in the world. A girl standing in an upright cabinet is is apparently kind of three pieces with the middle of her body pulled in to one side. It was quick it was quick it was co- it was copied so quickly that Harbin pushed a highly priced bro- book and the prop. It it was, okay. Harbin published a highly priced book in 1970 limited to 500 copies. That Harbin published in a highly priced book in 1970, limited to 500 copies, that allowed each pers- purchaser to build one version of the prop. It estimated that at least it is estimated. It is estimated that at least 15,000 zigzag illusions have been built to date, meaning 14,500 of them are unauthorized. Nick J- Nick Jansen from the UK has escaped from handcuffs locked on him by more than seventeen thousand wait seventeen thousand sixty one thousand seven hundred sixty one thousand seven hundred sixty different police officers around the world since nineteen fifty four. The <laughs> the International Magician Society. The International Magicians Society is the largest magic society with ser- with 37,000 members worldwide. The fastest magician alive is Eldon Wing- Wigton. Mm-hmm. It's Eldon Wigton who performed 225 tricks in 2 minutes for a world record attempt in 1991. While writing the Wizard of with the Wizard of Oz, author author L Frank Baum mm-hmm. Author L. Frank Baum modeled the wizard after Harry Keller, the most famous magician of all time. Of the time. Of the time. After establishing himself in Europe in the early 
nineteen hundreds. Mm-hmm. He Houdini brought over his younger brother Theo, the magician who had worked as his partner during early career. The Theo soon began performing his brother's tricks under the stage name Hardeen. The pair even created a phony rivalry to help boost their popularity. Even though Theo never became as fe- as famous as Houdini, he is now credited with having created an act of escaping a stride jacket from a straight jacket from a straight jacket in full view of the audience. Theo also in- inherited 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 hu- Houdini's stage equipment after his death and continued using it in performance in perform in perform- <laughs> in performances into the 1940s. Good job, Bye. Dill.